hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Kaden Campbell the diva if you're new here please go ahead and click the subscribe button and make sure that you click the bell to be notified each and every time I upload a video if you're a returning subscriber or a long time watcher welcome back and thank you guys so much or thank you so much for tuning in to this video now in today's video I'll be sharing with you guys my shave and shower winter routine because of the girls we don't get keep here we share what we know and if you haven't yet got on that trend now you will or if you just want to know and have other options you can tell people hey i see this girl do this you can go ahead and watch her and i'm the girl i'm your girl i'm the girl i'm that girl you need to tune in to the video you know what i'm saying and listen and watch and share so yeah i'm excited because your girl took some time to edit to, to, to film this video so i'm excited to share with you guys so if you want to see what i do please go ahead and keep on watching Okay, so welcome to the main event, guys. So first thing first, I was just get, greeting you guys in the shower and voguing a little bit because, you know, I'm all about me. <laughs> but the first thing I usually do is um, exfoliate my skin first before going in with any product to shave my skin. And in this episode or in this video, I'm using the Spa Scriptions African Black Soap. And this is an exfoliating body scrub with shea butter and charcoal now this product i have been using it for some time one thing i can say though it's very messy and it does leave stains in my washroom so you want to be mindful of that but it's really fine it's really good like i don't really have any issues with it it, ha it hasn't irritated my skin thus far and it smells good it feels good so what i normally do is just scrub my body first before i get into all the shaving and all that so I do the same thing with my whole body as well as my lips. Whatever I do from the top portion of my body because, you know, it's YouTube and we can't show everything. So whatever I do to the top portion of my body, I will be doing to the bottom portion. Now for shaving, I usually shave my legs only. I used to shave my arms back in the day, but I stopped because I find that it's not necessary for me. If you want to do it, you can, but I don't want to do it. So I just shave my legs. And my armpits and that's what I'll be doing in this video now I will get into some other more other information later on but let's start with this so I'm using this edge ultra sensitive shaving cream and this um, big simply smooth razor I've been using this razor for years I don't really switch it up I mostly use this brand the the the, the shaving cream I don't really specify it's whatever I see that there for sensitive skin I don't really discriminate against <laughs> shaving cream now I put on way too much shaving cream this is not necessary guys you want to be able to still see your skin under the shaving cream um, so try not to do that that's only this mistake I made um, I was just got carried away I, it was just too much so basically I just I do several passes because I go very lightly because my hand can get a little bit heavy I'm gonna want, and I don't want to cut myself. So I will suggest to do the, sh the shaving cream lighter than I did. And if you can go one pass, it's better. But I made several passes because it was too thick. So I just take my time. I use, very, I use a very light hand because you don't want to cut yourself. And I think on that day I did cut myself. But... Just be careful and just be mindful, okay? So once I'm done with shaving my legs, I usually go in with this exfoliating body polish in crushed almond and mango butter from Dove. Chef's
kiss absolutely love this product and i will be purchase, purchasing it again and trying other um scents it comes in love it as you can see it's almost done so i usually use my exfoliating gloves and i just go in and remove any extra dead cells dead skin <laughs> any hair that's left behind just to make sure that area is smooth and soft because that's what we want then once i'm done with that i usually go in to shave my armpits and guys i am aware that my underarm is darker than the rest of my body and i'm okay with it i've come to terms with it and i do not want any unsolicited advice on how to brighten my underarms i love it i'm a black woman and that's how it is and i do not wish to change it so thanks but But no thanks so yeah once i'm done with that i go in to nair my lady parts i just use this nair i've been using this nair for years i just put it on the area that i need to nair away mostly my bikini line and i just rub it off once the five minutes has come now it's time for me to go in and lather and soap my whole entire body and wash my entire body as a unit so i go in with this scent eyes shape butter and if you can't already tell i love me some shea butter and cocoa butter so much it's almost in all of the products that i use on my body i swear at least 98 percent or actually 95 percent of the products I use. so i use the oatmeal and shea butter um St. ives body wash and i go in with my rag i've been using a rag ever since i can remember my everything i can remember i love me my rag I will never trade it for nothing. I always use a rag. And I just go ahead and scrub all my areas, my legs, my feet, everything. I just wash from head to toe, okay? Then I wash that off and then I go in to wash the back because I like to use this brush. And I basically just brush away because I don't want to have back knee, so I do want to focus on my back. Some people, I feel like some people shower and tend to forget about their back well no, not this one i will be washing my back so i do that and then once i'm done i go in with the lady parts area and i go in with my feminine wash and i don't use any rag anything at all i use my hands my clean hands i put the soap and i lather it and i massage and wash the vulva area because you should not be getting the soap inside your lady parts just the vulva you scrub a dub dub and that is fine you use water and wash it away so i wash away my body again with some water then i go in to brush my teeth when i brush my teeth in the shower i like that it just makes me feel fresh from head to toe so i'm using the um harm and hammer harm and hammer okay um complete care gel top by top i love this I use it most of the time like I usually don't switch it up but if I do I use the Sensodyne but I really love this product it's sometimes harsh for me but I just love how it makes my teeth sparkles and how fresh my breath is really love it and I usually just use the technique my dentist tell me to use to brush my teeth to make sure all the plaque and everything is removed from my teeth and I have nice beautiful sparkling smile because yes that's what we want now once I'm done I wash off again and then I use my rag to clean my ears, behind my ears, because my mom, my mother told me if I'm a little picnic, make sure you wash behind your ears because you don't want your ears for molly. So make sure you do that. If you're not doing it, make sure you do it. Clean your ears. And I do this every time I shower. Then once I come out of the shower, I go in with my um tooth, my floss, my dental floss, and I floss my teeth. Then I go in with my my face care, but then this is a skin the skincare portion. So I'm using my cocoa 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 butter lotion and I'm using this Johnson Shea and Cocoa Butter um gel oil. Love this. I initially bought this to try with my daughter and then I fell in love with it and I keep buying it for myself. So I use two different oils, but this is the one that I'm using right now. I use another one that I have in another routine. You can you I still use it, I still love it, but this is the one I was using this day. So I have two different oils. I use different products. I don't stick to one thing all the time. So yeah, I go in and I lotion my skin. And I just love how soft it makes my skin feel. How glowy my skin feels. And I have no issues with any of these products 
no irritation and i just rub that in and it just glows naturally because that what that's what we want okay we want nice soft pretty good girl skin then you know we don't want a green arm no so we go in with our deodorant and i'm using the lady speed stick deodorant in invisible powder scent it's good but i love my dog but i ran out of my dog so i just use this as my backup then i go in with my ariana grande thank you next body mist or body spray love this scent so much i've been using it for some time and i love it so you know i just had to spray this on and guys i do this every single night it doesn't matter how tired i am i'm going to shower and i'm going to do this step so yeah thank you guys so much for watching <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for my upcoming videos. I do see the support, and I appreciate it so much, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Bye.